Hello and Assalamualaikum everyone My name is Nur Ain binti Suhimi Third year BEE student Under supervision of Encik Sharizal bin Sa'ad And I would like to present my project Entitled Development of Embedded Controller For Fleet Management System Let me give you a quick idea on what is FMS So Fleet Management System Keep records of all the vehicles The organization has purchased leasing and other maintenance activities driver record gps record and fuel so fleet management so fleet management software has the capacity to generate reports sending email basically helps in doing an analysis it is commonly known as vehicle management system which make things simple fast and better to operate and manage I will next proceed with problem statement. So fleet management need to monitor several aspects such as battery condition, engine oil, tire, insurance, road tax and some other features. Fleet company such as lorry or bus business, all the items in checklist will be updated manually by driver. Sometimes the limits for gearbox and engine oil is over and forget to be replaced due to human factor. This can indirectly affect the fleet operation leading to vehicles breakdown and accident during operation. Next, please take a look on the idea of integration system of my project of my proposed project from the vehicles. We need a device to log the activity of the vehicles before sending it to cloud server and before the maintenance team are notified about the whole operation going on. So, there are three objectives from this project. Firstly, is to develop embedded controller which are able to log all important data such as mileage in order to notify maintenance department. Next, to monitor vehicle speed movement on road simultaneously and in real time. Third, to minimize vehicle's downtime and operating costs by notifying maintenance team to check on battery, tire, engine oil and gearbox oil replacement. This project is to continuous monitoring the vehicles in real time. Hence, the authorities are Hence, authorities will send alert message to maintenance team when essential parameter goes beyond normal range. Fleet management system is to control and reduce vehicle repairing costs by developing microcontroller that can fulfill system criteria in data acquisition and integration of few subsystem is the best method to meet system objective. So, for the scope of research, we will first collect data from ECU and transfer to server for monitor purpose. Then, we will have data logging from embedded controller in notifying maintenance department due to mileage or any other important information needed to take action. Next, monitor the vehicle speed from the OBD reading. Use GPS and GSM to track and monitor vehicles simultaneously and in real time. Lastly, keep the maintenance date and data obtained from vehicle in management database to be continuously monitored by management authorities. Alright, for the literature review and reference, here I attach a table of the summary. There's actually a lot of literature review and reference but I choose these three as my top referred paper so basically the first one is smart fleet monitoring system using IOT in which it uses simple sensor to monitor the status of the vehicles so these paper are proven effective to reduce the fuel consumption in fleet over the same distance travel so they basically compare the system implementation before and after and measured by fuel consumption next the next paper would be 
design and implementation of wireless OBD to fleet management system. So in this paper, they design OBD reader just like what I'm doing. They implement GPS tracking to determine the location of the vehicles. So basically, the, the project is effective because the system is capable of reading various parameters successfully process, transmit and display the reading for the authorities to read. The next one would be car e-talk and I car e-talk and IoT enable cloud assistance smart fleet management. So this paper would be uh, they require real time via the Arduino microcontroller before transferring it to uh, application through application access to the smartphone called car e -talk. so it's a so it is effective in providing real-time vehicle health um, analysis next all right so we will have microcontroller acting as obd scanner and then the microcontroller will be inject at the obd port in the vehicles all right then after the obd scanner is detected it will read diagnostic trouble code from ecu and the data login process will take place once the information is obtained it will send straight to database if there is any component or wearing out components maintenance team will take action and if there is nothing wrong with the components the data will send back to the database for monitoring purpose so project implementation planning i divided into two psm phase one and psm phase two for psm phase one i study the problem statement research objective and do literature review on past work i do research and get the information reference from all type of source including journal website and book and then I start to design the system concept. For the upcoming phase PSM2, I will start to develop the hardware and software and will do the design testing, analyze the result and if the project is succeed, we will proceed with project documentation. By the end of this project, I, will, I was expecting an embedded controller and a monitoring system for the maintenance team that's all from me thank you